Honey, tell Nicki Minaj and Beyonce, I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling my feeling myself. Cause I feel like somebody's son gonna love me one day. <laughs> one day. Do y'all see what she did? I mean, honey, let me know if I completed the task. I mean, I said I wanted to give y'all an eyeshadow look. I gave y'all a full face look. And honey, honey, it's given. Stop playing with her. <laughs> Not to be played with. Period, poo. Look, somebody, son, gonna love me one day. Hey, one day. Look at, listen, honey. Get into that. Get into that. Ooh. Huh. Ooh, yes. Mm-hmm. Hey people and welcome back to the Plus Size Vixen YouTube channel. If you're new, hello, hi, welcome, have a seat and make sure you subscribe to this channel. In today's video, I decided to play with some eyeshadows. It's by e.l.f. Have some eyeshadows because I'm thinking about adding eyeshadows to my cosmetics line. But I didn't want to add nothing that I didn't actually use. I mean, I usually get away with adding a little gold to shimmer my little tear ducts and keep it pushing. But we're going to try today. My first time doing eyeshadow. So we're going to do a full beat, eyeshadow, and everything else. But before we get started, make sure you subscribe to this YouTube channel and hit that notification bell so you know every time I upload a new video. Let's get it started. Okay, so my face is nice and clean. Nothing on it. So I always start my makeup with primer. I use e.l.f. Poreless Primer because I have very oily skin. So I use a little bit of this primer. Put it like boop boop. I don't know. I From different makeup artists, I hear them say pat it in. Some people say rub it in. Listen, let me have a disclaimer. I'm not a makeup artist and I don't claim to be one. But I am thinking about going to school for it because I really do love cosmetics. So stay tuned for that, honey. We might blog all that. But, you know, that's down the line. Okay, it's all in. Let's get to the foundation. Now, I know I said I was going to do foundation next. But usually I do my eyebrows first, then foundation. So this might be a little ghetto. But to help my eyebrows out, I use a little edge control by Edge Boost. And I put a little bit, little fingertip on my eyebrows, rub them in, get a little bit for that side. And I take my eyebrow, I guess you could call this an eyebrow brush comb. Let's move the hair out the way. And I brush them up some. This, this listen, it does a trick for me. Y'all see that? See how sitting up? See? That's what I be needing. Yes to the eyebrow edge booster. <laughs> now, I'm concealing my brows. I'm using this concealer by LA Colors. Something I found at um Family Dollar. So it's usually, this probably under three dollars. So now I'm just making sure each brow is lined up. I always start on this side first, cause I guess my left side, since I'm left-handed, it just makes more sense for me. Yeah, so I mean believe me trust the process we're gonna clean all that up and then I take some of this same concealer and I put it under my eyes and also I can seal around my mouth my mouth lines because um yeah we want it to be concealed
and again around my eyes not too too much but just enough get a little more I usually when I squeeze this tube I keep it away from me because it likes to pitch out so just in case you're dressed you have your outfit on for the day you, I would hate for you to get this on your outfit so just kind of keep it a little away from you so we're gonna let that sit for a minute and beat that in and then put the foundation new yo Rudy so I just got finished adding my tinted moisturizer, tinted moisturizer by Maybelline to my face as y'all can see, I cleaned up one brow area, of course, the left side like always. So now I'm going to kind of just, again, take my beauty blender, kind of swiftly get the concealer, get a little bit more from off of there, and finish blending in my tinted moisturizer. And that's by Maybelline. What color is this? It's 375, I guess. I'm not too sure of the color, but the number of the color is 375. Then I go in with my e.l.f. Flawless Finish on Foundation. And this is, hold on. I should. So now I have added my e.l.f. Matted Finish. What is going on today? my flawless finish foundation this is in the color chocolate and i'm going to like blend this in a little bit i don't know about y'all but i think i use my beauty blender for a little bit of everything I know when I be on YouTube, a lot of people use different brushes. This is why I'm so interested in going to makeup school to actually know what brushes for what. Because one time I tried to use a brush to put on my foundation. And honey, it was a no-no. I was like, what is going on here? <laughs> it was giving me no-no. So my beauty blender has become my friend. So I just got finished priming my eyes. I'm excited, but let me show y'all some of the um, eyeshadow I have. This whole set is by Sephora, as y'all can see right there. And I'm gonna do, since it's like full time, different shades of brown. I I'm gonna stick to something neutral. We ain't gonna go too crazy, and we're gonna go into the e.l.f. and maybe use some of like the golds and the shimmers. So I got it primed, so I'm kind of waiting to let it set a little bit. I'm going to blend it in so we can get ready to try some eyeshadows. I'm excited because, you know, this is my first time doing this. <laughs> so if I jack up, be with me. Be with me. Lord have mercy, Lord, Father God, no, please don't mess this up. Please don't mess up in Jesus' name. We pray. Amen. Amen. <laughs> So, so far, I'm starting with a dark brown color, and I'm starting that for the outside. Hold on, let me show y'all the color, because I am over here trying, honey. Hold on. Oop. This color right here. Starting with a dark brown. I wonder, is it blending more into my skin? But we're going to go into a lighter color. So be with me. Let me just start the base. Let's just start the base. Let's get it started in here. You know what's so funny? Every time I used to get my makeup done, makeup artists used to be like, oh my God, I love your eyelids. You got so much space to play with. And I used to be like, what the hell does that mean? But now I see what they talk about. It's all this right here. So that's what we're doing. We're like getting ready to. Just so I got the first part on. I got the dark brown. So we're going to go in there with some orange. As y'all can see, I concealed again. So I'm going to start putting in the orange. Hold on. I just realized I did a little mistake. So let me kind of blend this. All right blend this so now we're gonna go into the orange Ooh, 
Oh Lord, I hope I'm doing this. Hope I'm not feeling my YouTubers that I was watching. Cause Lordy Lord. I need to look at my mirror. Okay. I do see some orange in there. Also, this is a blending eye brush. If y'all <laughs> so we back. Is it giving what it said is giving? I blended some browns and some oranges. Honey. This right here. And now I'm adding in a shimmer. <laughs> you, I'm just sitting here like, is it giving what it said it's giving? Hold on. I mean, I definitely like what I see. I have to give it to the professionals. I got to. I just want to know what can I use? All right. So now I'm trying to get fancy and give y'all a little bit of eyeshadow under the eye. Now see, this is when fancy gone wrong. Where's that beauty blender? <laughs> fancy gone wrong. You know what? It doesn't look horrible. I'm still not there yet with the YouTubers and the makeup artists. But um I could definitely say your girl tried. I can definitely say that much. We got some gold, some oranges, some shimmers. I definitely tried, honey. All right. So I, I definitely think I tried my best. And I'm happy I was able to rock with y'all to do this. Because I'm going to try to leave y'all pins down at the bottom. What can I have done better? The yays, the nays. You know, this is honestly my first time. Like I said early in the video, all I do is a little like something in the the, the um the tear ducts. Like I'll do something like that. I'll put a little shimmer and I'll be like, honey, <laughs> put my la put my lashes on, my black um what is this called? Liquid liner and call it a day. I never even did all this. So I'm feeling real fancy right now. But we still, we still blending. They said the trick to makeup is just blending. Gotta keep blending. So as y'all see, I told y'all I got my liquid liner on. This be the trickiest part. Because the wrong blank could mess up this whole thing. I must be running low because I usually could do this in one good hit. And the trick I learned, you got to look away. Don't really try to look. Look away. Oop. Okay. think we almost done. honey <laughs> that liquid liner honey y'all better invest in this so now i just take a little mascara to flick out my um my little bit of lashes i got flick them out a little bit and then we're gonna add our falsies on because you know falsies make everything so, this is my little pack I got right here. And I'm going to pick a falsy lashes to try on. Okay, so this little pack, I order a lot of stuff from China. So, please excuse that. You know, I, you know, 
that was a sample of lashes I got. I wanted to see if it was given what it was given. But while we waiting for the full seats to dry, I am going to put a little bit of um, powder on my face. So, you know, we can get ready to complete our look and we're going to do our lips. Yes, honey, I did not forget. If anything I know how to do, if not eyeshadow, I know how to do these lips, honey. And we are going to use today a lipstick from MAC and a lip gloss from NYX. Because, again, I'm doing a full color. So, just beat that powder in. You must set that face. I even get down here on my neck. Sorry, I want my oh, everything to be blended. Everything to be blended right. So now that we set the face, now I got a black lip liner. I know you probably be like, girl, what are you doing with that liner? Trust the process. And I usually pull it in more on my corners. I know y'all probably like, she's still doing it? Yes, I am. Mm-hmm. So last winter, ooh, I was gifted this lipstick from MAC. And it's called Velvet Teddy Bear. So I wanted to use it. Okay. Since I was going for... more of a full look I want you to blend in the lip liner and the lipstick so it look more smudged it look more pulled out instead of so perfect because this look is not to have like a black liner so Honey, <laughs> sis could do some lips now. So now I'm going to add a little bit of NYX Butter Gloss. This is Bit of Honey. And I just want to add a little bit of my lip gloss to it. This is Classic Nude. As y'all can see, I've since been using it. And this is by Plus Size Vixen Cosmetics. So if you're interested in it, definitely check out PlusSizeVixen.com. Mm -hmm. See, this is the look I was... Honey. These lips... It's saying ooh la la. Listen, I got so good at putting on my little full C lashes. I be like, hold on, go to the hair salon or go to a lash tech and pay. Why do that? Yes, honey. Get you some tweezers like this. Set that glue. And what also help is put that liquid liner so you can see the line of your lash. Honey. And just make sure it's pressed on. Honey. Honey. Hopes on. 
I feel like I'll be like, who's that girl? Na 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 na. Look, get that here, somebody. Hold up. Stop playing with her. Stop playing with her. Get out here, somebody. Adi, 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 adi. A lot of body. Look, it's all tapered on the side, honey. Listen, I ain't sure if I kill this eyeshadow look or not, but it looks good to me. It looks good to me. Ooh. <laughs> Them lips is juicy. Mmm. <laughs> hey. Ooh, I'm gonna be somebody's son one. Hold up, one day, 